In this video, we'll be making a tune shader using Unity's new scriptable render pipeline, or SRP for short. We have a demo project here with an example scene rendered with a customized version of Unity's lightweight render pipeline. If we enter play mode, we will see the characters animate and the camera cycle through several views of our tune shaded scene. These assets are available as a free download at the link in the description below. The project contains a customized rendered pipeline asset the two different outline effect shaders, pre-configured forward rendering data assets, and an example scene for you to get started. Our tune shaded scene is created through a custom scriptable render pipeline based on the pre-built lightweight render pipeline. Unity's scriptable render pipeline lets you tailor the rendering process to your target platform so you can optimize performance for specific hardware while achieving your desired style of rendering. This gives you the ability to configure rendering in Unity from c -sharp scripts, which will enable you to customize rendering processes to suit your art style and game, and control how available performance resources are used. Let's create our tune shader by extending the default lightweight pipeline with our custom tune post effect shader. First, create a new pipeline asset by selecting Assets, Create, Rendering, Lightweight Render Pipeline, Pipeline Asset. This will create a new render pipeline asset based on Lightweight. Next, we will create a new custom forward renderer asset by selecting Assets, Create, Rendering, Lightweight Render Pipeline, Forward Renderer. Our tune shading effect is created from two main elements, the outline effect, which adds lines around the edges of rendered meshes, and the posterize effect, which reduces the number of colors in our image. We will add the two effects to our new pipeline as renderer features by using the Blit Custom Renderer feature, which is included in the project. The Blit Custom feature provides a simple method of adding a basic Blit operation with a material into our custom render pipeline. We will be using this Blit to perform a post effect with our Tune Effect shader. We have two different Tune Effect shaders in this provided project the Tune Basic Outline, and the Sobo Filter. For this tutorial, we will be using the Sobo Filter. The Sobo Filter is a post-process effect that uses the Sobo operator to detect edges in an image. It optionally also has a posterize feature, which reduces the number of colors for a more stylized look. Assign the Sobo Filter shader to a new material named Outline Tune underscore Sobo Blit. To link the Sobel effect to our custom renderer pipeline, select the Tune Forward Renderer asset. In the empty list of renderer features, click the plus button to add a new renderer feature and choose the Blit menu option. Name this new feature Sobel Outlines. Set the event to run after rendering transparents, which means our effect will run after all opaque and transparent meshes are drawn. Set the Blit material to our Outline Tune Sobel Blit material. Set the Blit Material Pass Index to 0. Next, make sure the destination is set to Color. The Texture ID should be underscore Blit Pass Texture. Our custom forward renderer is ready. In our custom lightweight asset, select the renderer type as Custom, and then assign our custom forward renderer data with the Sobel filter. To render our scene with our new pipeline, open Edit, Project Settings, Graphics, and assign our new pipeline asset to the scriptable render pipeline settings field. Our custom pipeline now has the Sobel outline effect working. Note that we can adjust the material we assigned and see the results in real time. These steps can all be repeated for the Tune Basic Outline shader or any other compatible post process shader to add it to our custom render pipeline. If you'd like to experiment with these features yourself, we have provided the complete project with all assets, meshes, shaders, and an example scene for you to download via a link in the description below. We look forward to seeing what cool stuff you create with it. Thanks for watching.